Hi, this is Helmut Flash, and um, I have a hot topic for you, and that is the price cutting. You know, they undercut the price uh, so that you're equal and lower than the competition because you got to outsell your competition on price, and that, my dear friends, doesn't work. Okay, you'll go broke. Every company who starts price cutting will go broke. You cannot sell a cup of coffee for a dollar if it costs a dollar then to make it. Okay, it isn't possible, and that's all there is to it. And uh, no people, yes, people will buy from you maybe. Just like right now, you have 75% discounts in the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the, you know, garment store and all those type of stuff. Well, most likely we will see another flood of bankruptcy coming along simply because even though their revenues are up or not down too much, their money, they're not making any money. It doesn't work. However, what does work is extremely insane low loss leaders. What is a loss leader? It is an introductory service to get your people to come in. And that would work whether you're a car mechanic or a dentist or a cardiologist, okay? It does work. Now, and even if you just don't, don't get fancy now with insurance and all, please, just, just don't get fancy. There are ways to do that. You might have to learn about it. But, you know, right now, and, you know, many of our clients, for instance, are dentists. Get them in with something which is insanely profound. I mean, it's, it's, it's just, just insane low. You lose money. Your colleagues, your friends, your neighbors, and your spouses need to tell you that you're completely out of your mind doing such a loss, low loss leader. Now, many of you people will tell us that when you do that, you attract a certain bad clientele. Absolutely not true. What happens is it's the state of mind, except if your service is really bad, then of course many people, they'll come, they do the test drive and they will go. But 99% service and things is not bad with, with people, it's all perfectly fine. But what is bad is the state of mind of you and your staff. You and your staff think and they feel that when people come in for a, such a low loss leader that they now not buy. It's your attitude. Uh, also, you might have to learn that then presenting the rest of the service which the person needs has nothing to do with the loss leader. You don't need to cut back there. You don't, need to, you, you don't need to get the picture that the guy who comes in for a loss leader is a poor person. I had a dentist in Beverly Hills, actually right outside Beverly Hills, okay? Having a lady coming in with a loss leader, which was insanely loss leader, okay, and guess what? All her services was 1,000% paid by the insurance because she was the wife of an ambassador to the United States from some other country. There was nothing she didn't get paid. And she came for a loss leader. Now, if that can happen, do you think that normal people come for a loss leader? 12 years ago, I bought a Jaguar. And the guy was talking about low entrance price and whatever he can do. And I looked at him and I said, gee, I said, um, do people who buy a Jaguar really worry about 500 or 800 or 1,000 dollar less down payment or something like that? And he says, well, you'll be the first one who doesn't. I looked like an, I, I felt like an idiot because it's, you know, I came across like this nouveau rich kind of, and uh, yeah, I wasn't. It's, it's kind of, I go, yeah, actually, why not? Why would I not care about getting less, uh, you know, getting a, a good entrance deal. Ladies and gentlemen, you've got to give that and you've got to perhaps learn a little bit about it, but the main picture is there. A loss leader gets people in, everyday low prices is going to get you broke. And that is undisputable. It will not work any other way. Do not oversee the loss leader as an enormous tool. You might have to get creative about it. You might have to look at a bunch of more videos of mine, all kinds of other things, obviously. You, but you got to be having a, not just an open mind towards it, but doing it. Go ahead.